I was really shocked. Yeah, I had no idea. At first I didn't think it was true. I actually, I thought it was a hoax. I received a letter, that's how I got the news. And everybody was freaking out, like, is this real? I got this email, I got this letter. Go check the mail. And I'm like, well, I guess I'm getting a free iPad for school. Until you actually hold the iPad and start, you know, sort of working with it, it's really tough to appreciate what that size and closeness and the interface brings to the equation. You just connect in a different way. It's more engaging, and it almost immediately made some sense in an art environment that this is something with a lot of potential. In one device, they have the ability to research, to communicate, to organize information, and actually to produce art. So it's like one-stop shopping. This is indicative of this major trend in technology that no longer is technology something that you interface with in a dark room, right? That's not something that engenders creativity, but taking it out into the real world and enabling it to become just part of everybody's daily life and process, I think is amazing. We saw a lot of possibilities with the iPad as a tool. In terms of our new curriculum elements and then the other courses that we do as well, and I think for the students as well as for all the faculty, it's been this great learning experience. At first, I just thought the iPad was like unnecessary. The kind of art I do would never be suitable for that, but it's been amazing. It's actually changed the way I draw by hand. It's a very personal experience in creating your artwork because it's just with the touch of your hand. I'm not really that great with technology, but I got better and better with it. You know, some people helped me out. Once I got a handle of it, I learned all the things I could do with it. There's a whole world opened up to you with the iPad. How the iPads have changed the classroom experience is that we have this tool that is very intuitive and it's easy to carry around with you all the time. So it sort of gives us immediate access to any topic or any particular artist or a process or a technique. We can say, hey, everybody, you know, go to this website, and then we can hold them up and share them with each other. So it enables us to have kind of a more improvisational experience because we don't have to go reserve AV equipment and we don't need a dark room and things like that. So in that sense, the immediacy of it has been terrific. They don't know the world before iPad. Now, they don't know college pre-iPad. They record lectures, they take notes on their iPad, they, they type on the iPad, they send me emails on the iPad, they send photos of their projects. It's so fluid for a student that's working at home, snap a picture of their project, click a button, email it to me, then I write back and I'm seeing their project and I don't have to have an office visit. We can communicate that way. I feel like technology is part of you know, my arts career now. The freshman experience at the Cleveland Institute of Art has been fundamentally changed.